Said he? Huh, he's dead. Didn't they? They never let him out. He kept his head down. Helps people forget. People will remember soon enough. When they see him walking down the streets of their neighborhoods, it will be bad for business. Well, what are we gonna do, Sonny? Treat him like an old friend and keep him busy out of town. Okay. We've been talking about expanding down south, right? Vice City is 24 karat gold these days. The Colombians, the Mexicans, help. Even those Cuban refugees are cutting themselves a piece of some nice action. But it's all drugs, son. None of the family will touch that shit. Time to change it. The family can't keep the backs turned while our enemies reap the rewards. So, we sent someone down to do the dirty work for us and cut ourselves a nice cross. Who's our contact now? Ken Rosenberg. What's he gonna hold the city? We don't need him to. We just set him loose in Vice City. We give him a little cash to get started, okay? Here. Hey, hey, great, hey. Well, uh, I'm gonna drive you guys to the beat, okay? Now, I've talked to the suppliers and they are very uh, keen to start a business relationship. So, uh, if all goes well, we should uh, be doing very nicely for ourselves, which is, you know, good. Okay, so, they're brothers, okay? One operates the uh, business and the other one.
100% pure grade A Colombian, my friend. Let me see it. The greens? 10s and 20s, used. I think we have a deal, my friend. <laughs> oh, shit! I poked my head out of the gutter for one freaking second and fate shoveled shit in my face. Go get some sleep. What are you gonna do? I'll drop by your office tomorrow and we can start sorting this mess out. You got ID? We interrupt your programming with a message from the State Department. All bridges and some roads in the Vice City metropolitan area have been closed because of a severe weather warning. Meteorologists are tracking Hurricane Hermione, which has devastated five Caribbean islands and is heading for Vice City. More updates soon. Tommy! Tommy! It's been too long. I know, I know. You're just overwhelmed with emotion. Fifteen years. Seems like only yesterday. I guess that's a perspective thing. Hey, doing time for the family is no piece of cake, but the family looks after its own, okay? So how'd the deal go down? You sitting on some white gold? Look, Sonny, we were set up. The deal was an ambush. Harry and Lee are dead. You better be kidding me, Tommy! Tell me you still got the money! No, Sonny. I don't have the money. That was my money, Tommy! My money! You better not be screwing me, Tommy, because you know I'm not a man to be screwed with! Wait, Sonny! You have my personal assurance that I'm gonna get you your money back, and the drugs, and I'm gonna mail you the dicks of those responsible! Hey, I already know that. You're not a fool, Tommy, but I warn you, neither am I. If it was anybody else, you'd be dead already, but because it's you, because we got history, I'm gonna let you handle this. Look, Sonny, you got my word. I'll be in touch. Go get some sleep, he says. <laughs> I have been sitting in this chair all night with the lights off drinking coffee. This is a disaster. We are so screwed, man. 
These gorillas, listen to me, are gonna come down here and rip my head off. It's re ridiculous. I did not go to law school for this. Okay, now what the hell are we gonna do? Shut up, sit down, relax. I'll tell you what we're gonna do. You're gonna find out who took our cocaine, and then I'm gonna kill them. That's a good idea. That's a great idea. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh, there's this retired colonel, Colonel Juan Garcia Cortez. He's the one that helped me set up this deal well away from Vice City's established thugs, okay? Now listen, he's holding his party out in the bay on his expensive yacht and all of Vice City's big players are gonna be there, okay? I have an invite, of course I have an invite, but there's no way that I'm going out there sticking my head out the door, no I way, not I told you, happen. shut up, I'll go myself. Oh, whoa, 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 hey, I like 1978 too, but you know, this isn't gonna be a beer and strippers do. I mean, no offense, but I think that you might turn heads on the runway for the wrong reason. What's wrong with the way I'm dressed? Okay, look, here, stop by Raphael's, tell him I sent you. He'll make you look respectable. Okay, go, come on. Who does that guy think he is? Now I gotta dress like a chump as well as hang out with them? I like this shirt. Buenas noches. I understand you are here on the behalf of Mr. Rosenberg. I hope any recent problems have not affected his health or mental well-being, Mr. Rosetti. He's just got a touch of agoraphobia. <laughs> excellent, excellent. And you? I just want my merchandise. Ah, it's an unfortunate set of circumstances for all involved. Of course, I have initiated my own lines of inquiry, but such a delicate matter. Perhaps we will talk later. Meanwhile, let me introduce you. Mr. Davis! Caramia, would you look after our guest for my appointment? Dating one's enemies. Who's the loudmouth? Ricardo Diaz. 
is Mr. Cole. Mercedes! Oh, I was just taking my friend back into town. Another time, Ricardo. Ricardo, let's go. Let's get out of here. See you around, handsome. I'm sure you will. Well, I hope you're having a good time, because I'm going out of my mind with worry here. What did you find out? That there are more criminals in this town than in prison. We need a lead from the streets. Okay, let me think, let me think, let me think. Ah, I got it! Okay, there's this slimy, some music industry slimeball. Goes by the name of Kent Paul. Anyway, he's got his nose so far up most of Vice City's ass that if anybody knows the whereabouts of 20 keys of coke, it's this guy, all right? He's always at the Malibu. I'll go pay him a visit. Take it easy now. Come on, dance! Some English guy. Kent Paul. Kent Paul, mate. Yeah, I'm the governor, Andy. I'll sort things out. No, I mean, I'll treat you. Whatever you want, I'll get you, girl. Don't you worry about a thing. You're lost, honey. Oi, 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 oi. Kent Paul. A friend of Rosenberg's. 
What you looking at? You better start talking. Hey, make me, you prick. <sighs> oh, way to go, tough guy. Beat him to a pulp. That should make him real chatty. You want some too? Hey, chill. I want what you want, brother. Oh yeah? And what's that? Your green and my dead brother's white lady. Unfortunately, you just silenced our lead. Accidents happen. Get lost. Hey, hey, whoa. Well, no need to go all long range on my ass. The way I see it, we two hombres in a strange town. We need to watch each other's backs. My back's just fine, brother. You sure about that? Here, take this. Follow me. This way! Get out of here! Respond to a 10, 19, in Central, Washington Beach. I'm gonna go see what I can dig up. I've been watching you, Tommy.
Get out the way. Hey, uh, Leo, I think we got a buyer for Diaz's merchandise. Gotta give him a ring, man. Set up a deal, you know? Where are you now? You okay, Leo? You sound kinda different. Just tell me where you are. Who the hell is this? Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. Oh, oh, for God's sake, it's you! Oh, jeez! I'm gonna need new pants! Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon! Now where is the goddamn money?! Relax, relax. We're not at that part oh, yet. Oh, I thought that you were taking care of this! I really did! And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor! You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, oh of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out! I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no! I tried that! The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. All right, more crap to wipe up. What did I do wrong in a past life? Dumb Florida moron. I can't believe this is happening! Remember, guilty is a dirty word.
right now, man. Innocent until I say otherwise. <laughs> Sit on my knee. Hey, Tommy, it's Sonny. How's the suntan? I ain't got no suntan. We well, ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, Tommy, what are you doing? I'm looking for the money, Sonny. Charlie. Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style, because I seem to have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, <laughs> Tommy, please. Do us both a favor. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Go away! Avery goes without saying, Tommy, Tommy, any progress? No, 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 tell me later, tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party? Not in person. Howdy. Avery here has a proposition. <clears throat> Haven't we got other things on our mind? I'm trying to keep the wolves from the door. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any grease balls giving you a hard time, I'll see to it they take a long dirt nap. Okay. What could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. The security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop by Raphael's for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, go for it. Should be a riot. If the balls drop like they should, stop by my office sometime. Who are these pricks anyway? Lawyer pricks, rug-wearing pricks, surrounded by pricks. Final warning! 